Alexander Disease, Wikipedia Article Audio Alexander Disease, also known as fibrinoid leukodystrophy, is a progressive and fatal neurodegenerative disease. It is a rare genetic disorder and mostly affects infants and children, causing developmental delay and changes in physical characteristics. Plus AFS1 plus AF0 plus AFS2 plus AF0 plus AFS3 plus AF0. Delays in development of some physical, psychological, and behavioral skills and adds progressive enlargement of the head and AFS macrocephaly and AF0, seizures, spasticity, and in some cases also hydrocephalus idiopathic intracranial hypertension, and dementia. Plus AFS2 plus AF0. Presentation Cause Alexander disease is a genetic disorder affecting the midbrain and cerebellum of the central nervous system. It is caused by mutations in the gene for glial fibrillary acidic protein and AFS GFAP and AF0 plus AFS4 plus AF0 plus AFS5 plus AF0 plus AFS6 plus AF0 that maps to chromosome 17Q21. It is inherited in an autosomal dominant manner such that the child of a parent with the disease has a 50-plus ACU chance of inheriting the condition, if the parent is heterozygotic. However, most cases arise de novo as the result of sporadic mutations. Plus AFS2 plus AF0 Alexander disease belongs to leukodystrophies, a group of diseases that affect the growth or development of the myelin sheath. The destruction of white matter in the brain is accompanied by the formation of fibrous, eosinophilic deposits known as Rosenthal fibers. Plus AFS2 plus AF0 plus AFS3 plus AF0 plus AFS7 plus AF0 Rosenthal fibers appear not to be present in healthy people. Plus AFS3 plus AF0 plus AFS8 plus AF0 but occur in specific diseases, like some forms of cancer. Plus AFS3 plus AF0 plus AFS8 plus AF0 The Rosenthal fibers found in Alexander disease do not share the distribution or concentration of other diseases and disorders. Plus AFS3 plus AF0 Alexander disease causes the gradual loss of bodily functions and the ability to talk. It also causes an overload of long-chain fatty acids in the brain which destroy the myelin sheath. The cause of Alexander disease is a mutation in the gene encoding glial fibrillary acidic protein and AFS GFAP and AF0. Plus AFS2 plus AF0 plus AFS3 plus AF0 plus AFS4 plus AF0 plus AFS5 plus AF0 plus AFS9 plus AF0. ACT scan shows. It is possible to detect the signs of Alexander disease with magnetic resonance imaging and AFS MRI and AF0 which looks for specific changes in the brain that may be telltale signs for the disease. Plus AFS10 plus AF0 plus AFS11 plus AF0 It is even possible to detect adult onset Alexander disease with MRI. Plus AFS9 plus AF0 Alexander disease may also be revealed by genetic testing for the known cause of Alexander disease. Plus AFS12 plus AF0 plus AFS13 plus AF0 A rough diagnosis may also be made through revealing of clinical symptoms including, enlarged head size, along with radiological studies, and negative tests for other leukodystrophies. Plus AFS8 plus AF0 Pathology there is currently no cure or standard procedure for treatment. 
plus AFS2 plus AF0 plus AFS3 plus AF0 A bone marrow transplant has been attempted on a child, but it made no improvement. Plus AFS14 plus AF0 plus AFS15 plus AF0 hydrocephalus may be seen in younger patients and can be relieved with surgery or by implanting a shunt to relieve pressure. Plus AFS16 plus AF0. The prognosis is generally poor. With early onset, death usually occurs within 10 years from the onset of symptoms. Individuals with the infantile form usually die before the age of 7. Plus AFS17 plus AF0 Usually, the later the disease occurs, the slower its course is. Plus AFS2 plus AF0 plus AFS3 plus AF0 Diagnosis Its occurrence is very rare. The infantile form from birth to two years of age. Plus AFS6 plus AF0 The average duration of the infantile form of the illness is usually about three years. Onset of the juvenile form presents between 2 and 12 years of age. Plus AFS6 plus AF0 Duration of this form is in most cases about six years. The adult form from 12 years and older. Plus AFS6 plus AF0 in younger patients, seizures, megalencephaly, developmental delay, and spasticity are usually present. Neonatal onset is also reported. Plus AFS18 plus AF0 onset in adults is least frequent. In older patients, bulbar or pseudobulbar symptoms and spasticity predominate. Symptoms of the adult form may also resemble multiple sclerosis. Plus AFS2 plus AF0 There are no more than 500 reported cases. Plus AFS2 plus AF0 Ankirin, Long QT Syndrome 4 Treatment Prognosis Prevalence Decreased density of white matter and adds frontal lobe predominance and adds dilated lateral ventricles. Hereditary spherocytosis 1